Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Francesco and what I do in these videos is break down productivity tips, tools and techniques to help you move forward in your productivity. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother... So as you can see in the top left hand corner, what we'll be doing today is focusing in on an application called Everlist. It's been something I'm meaning to check out for a while now and I've been chatting with a few people on Twitter, I think it was Chad Hall and the founder of this application, Salomon, um, who basically have obviously suggested for me to do this one. And let's get stuck into this review. So Everlist is a free application. Um, I checked it out really fast in the six productivity apps to check out, and I'll link that just above. So what this application is, is it's a very simple kind of workspace display. So as you can see, you can go in and see all of the areas of your lifestyle. You know, these are kind of boards. It looks very similar to kind of Trello mixed with, obviously, Evernote. So as you can see, I've got inbox, work, they've displayed groceries and travel as some other options. So what I can do down here is I can see how many I've got, how many tasks I've got today, how many I've got this week, and how many I've got in total. So if I go into inbox, this is essentially where I'm gonna put all of the uh, activities that I'm gonna do. So all you have to do is, it's very simple, you get to add tasks down at the bottom. You can enter a task, so if I had to type in test, you can choose it for, you know, today, tomorrow, next week, and it gives you the actual date that it's going to be on, which is quite valuable. I'm just going to hit pick, pick another day, and a real simple kind of tally board comes up there. I can choose the folder it goes into, so work, travel, etc. if I had more, and add a reminder to it, repeat, and add note. A very simplistic but quite nice-looking way to add your notes. So let me just add that one, and it goes straight to the bottom, obviously, adds things categorically. So obviously, here's today, and here's future events. So this is quite valuable to see it in a nice view like this. To simply complete a task, you just tap it, and very much like other applications like any do, you can see that it's been uh, you know, completed. You can dismiss it by hitting the X. Simply swipe to the right to complete a task as well, which is quite cool. Uh, and you can swipe the other way to, for scheduling it another time. Very similar to some other applications that do this. I really like the way they're using gestures as well in this application. Seems really, really simple. The editing as well, very, very clever, very fluid in their transitions. Going back out of this, you can also obviously see all of the other tasks that you've got. What's nice about this is you can see the kind of, if there's no due date, they'll prioritize them by one, two, and three. And so you can also see at a glance what all is available. So these are from all of your different notebooks, uh, which is quite nice. And obviously you can see all of today if I had any tasks for today. So that's quite valuable. On the left-hand side, uh, simply tapping the menu button up in the top right allows you to edit each of the folders, kind of categorize them, uh, which can be really, really valuable. Uh, you can even change the names too, which is great. And then down here, it's just requesting features and icons. So it's something that's very, very simple. As you can imagine, they just launched recently. So it's something they're continuing to improve. So definitely I'll tag them on Twitter in this and also add it in the description. And it's something to check out because I think this app has got something in it. I think if they tag, if they blend in some other applications, bring this to web, uh, bring it to Mac and all the other services, I think it could have some real simplistic abilities with a lot of productivity individuals. So thank you very much, everyone. Make sure to have a great week. Keep productive, and I'll see you very soon. Cheers.